How's it guys? Welcome back to the channel. For this video, I've put together three separate observations from the 21st of June, which was the winter solstice, and compared it to the corresponding three observations for a month later, the 21st of July, 2021. I've used the shadow of the tower at sunrise, where the sun set, and where Venus was. My main concern with the flat earth objection of the earth rotating on its own axis and revolving around the sun is that on the winter solstice is the furthest point north that the sun will appear in my sky before it starts heading back south again. So my main question is, what mechanism is in place to stop these objects at these certain points and start heading in the opposite direction across the horizon. So, even though the sun is traveling at its own velocity around the Milky Way galaxy, the planets don't really notice it. And that is because the sun is dragging the whole entire solar system with it. So if we are traveling with the sun, we are not going to see the sun doing its orbit around the Milky Way, which, by the way, takes about 230 million years. And what we experience here on Earth is only because the planet is rotating on its own axis. That's why we see the sun appear on the one horizon, travel over your head and disappear beyond the opposite horizon. It's not the sun doing that. If it was the sun doing that, what mechanism is in place to stop it at the solstices and make it go back in the opposite direction? No. It's the Earth rotating on its own axis that makes us see the objects in the sky as we do. And I do realize that I sound like a broken record as I keep rehashing this question, what mechanism is in place to stop the sun and make it go back in the opposite direction? Because... If the sun and all these objects are orbiting the earth and there is no mechanism to stop it, then the trajectory should carry on and eventually and periodically and consequently sunrise and sunset should flip. But that does not happen in reality. And that is because the earth goes around the sun. That's it for this little comparison video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please comment, give the video a like, subscribe, and ring that bell. All other links in the description. Please, guys, stay safe, and I'll catch you in the next video. Bye.